In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the setup of your Epson Workforce 2960 all-in-one printer with the Windows laptop. First step is to switch on the printer and now go to your Windows laptop, open web browser, type in Epson Workforce WF2960 driver. Scroll down and look for the Epson website with your printer name Epson Workforce 2960 printers. Select it. Scroll down and look for your printer. So that is our printer. Select downloads. Wait for your operating system to show up. Download the drivers and utility combo package installer. Open file. Click yes. Click OK to install. It will take you to the download window. Accept terms and conditions. You can select the additional agreements or you can just deselect it and click next. Click next for the setup. On the next screen you have to select the option. The first option is connect via wireless network. So if you have a home Wi-Fi network you can use this method. Go to your printer display panel. Scroll ahead and click on the settings. General settings, network settings, Wi Fi setup, Wi Fi recommended. Click on the others, Wi Fi auto connect, start setup, and click next. On the next page, you have to select your Wi Fi network. On the next page you can select the software you want to download and then click on the install button or you can just select the required software and click install. Now we can print a test page so click on the print test page. You can lift the panel and also you can extend the paper output tray. Finish the setup process click next. You can update your printer or you can skip this software is installed. Now we can finish and register your product. So it will open a new window to register or you can just do it later. Setup is complete. So this way we can do the setup of this printer using a Windows laptop. And now we can start using it for printing and scanning. For example, if I print a document, so I can just open it, click on the print icon. On the next page automatically it will select your printer if not you can select from here and then click on the print thanks for watching